Hey and welcome back to Emerald Coasting. Today's episode we're going to go over how to make your own uh, kayak anchor float. Uh, really inexpensive and real easy to do. So hope you enjoy the episode. Alright, first thing we want to do is we're going to drill some holes. I've already drilled part of this one. Turn this down a little bit. Alright, now that we've got our holes drilled, we're going to take our line, stick it through the PVC, and feed it through until we get it to come out one of the ends. There you go. So you're feeding it through the center, pulling it out through one of the ends. All right, now that we've got the hole drilled in the middle, we've got our line pulled, we've got our float. Just pull a needle, we stick one on each side. Then we're going to feed this end through one of our caps. like so and then we'll glue these this cap on and our next cap is a little bit different but kind of the same we'll show you all right now we're going to take the other end cap and we're going to feed just a little bit through tie a couple of knots Let's keep it from pulling through the other side. Check your knots real good. Give it a good tight pull. There you go. Alright, I've added a little primer. So now we're going to take our PVC glue and we're going to glue glue our caps on. Take throw your little glue on there. Put some glue on the other end. Inside the cap. That side's done. Now all we gotta do is do this side. Same thing. We'll glue on the cap. We'll glue on the end. Feed that back through. And push it on. There we go getting to look like a little something. So anyway, now we'll let this dry, cure up, and uh, then we'll finish it up. The rest of it's pretty simple. Uh, not a whole lot to it. Okay, when you get done, you're gonna roll this up. There you go. Got your lines on each side. 
got one in your main line and then you've got your extra and you might want to take tie a little knot on the top of this one just to keep it from sliding back down it won't pull out but it can pull back down I'll give it a little room okay now that you've got everything done put your carabiner on each side this side your main line will clip to either your boat or your anchor trolley you're wondering what this side's for once you let out however much anchor line you need this is once you get enough out just take a couple of wraps and it won't feed anymore and that'll keep it from unraveling on you while it's floating out there in the water And lastly, tying up your anchor. Uh, I tie mine here to the bottom. And that way if it gets hung up, if you happen to get hung up, comes up top, you've got a zip tie. If you pull hard enough, your zip tie will break. This way your rope will flip around, you can pull back out. So if you're hung up on something, it'll help you get unhung. Uh, I didn't come up with this. I've um, seen a million people do it and it uh, seems to be the smart way to tie. So anyway, that's your DIY kayak anchor float. Hope you uh, learned a little something, enjoyed the video. And uh, it's cheap, it's easy. I think I've got, uh, notwithstanding the anchor, uh, just the float itself. Uh, I might have about $5 tied up in this. Uh, there's not a whole lot to it. They're simple and uh, easy to make. All right, well, I hope you enjoyed today's episode of Emerald Coasting. Um, if you did enjoy it, please like, please subscribe, and we'll catch you next time. Thank you.